Check one, two, three. Today is June 10, 2011 uh, at Harvard University Law School. Um, after an extraordinary, extraordinary symposium at the Beckman Center, internet law, society, surveillance, public space, hyper-public configurations were dealt with today with a swift hand by a number of dramatic speakers. It's been a very rich day. We've covered a lot of grounds. Uh, uh, we had, you know, um, speakers from various disciplines introducing their views and perspectives on the topic um, privacy and, and, and the public, uh, and how you know digital technologies actually uh, blurred the lines between these two poles. For me, the delight is actually to watch people from different disciplines come together and, and really grapple with really hard questions. And so the nice thing about this community is you're bringing together the folks who are really thinking about design, have architecture, sort of a historical sense, people who are thinking about technology, people who are thinking about law, and the sort of social scientists. And so it's, the, it's amazing moment where you can see sort of common thread and total disconnects. The difference in perspective between those who are engaged largely in managing and developing information um, infrastructures versus the perspective of people involved in the curation and um, construction of, of actual physical public spaces and the intersection between the two brought a very rich set of perspectives that don't necessarily converge in, in terms of their core values. It certainly um, expanded my notion of, of the, the alternatives to, to privacy. And I think that the ways in which we th were able to see today different definitions of publicness the move between physical and virtual spaces was really exciting. Uh, very deep observation on uh, human communication, which is not only always about communicating, but also about uh, creating groups, uh, finding your identity in uh, self-formed groups, and uh, it's also about inviting people in and keeping people out of communications. Uh, I found this uh, very interesting.